Hello and welcome to another video. My name is Daniel from Palatine Pickups and um, today I'm going to show you my new pickup set which is a uh, Jazzmaster pickup set. Um, before I'd like to show you some sounds I'm going to talk about uh, Jazzmaster pickups. The thing with Jazzmaster pickups is they're oftentimes misconcepted as uh, P90 pickups or um, People say, yeah, they're just a little bit of thing, more fatter P90s, and um, I'm going to show you the difference. So this is a Jazzmaster pickup, and uh, th this one is a P90 pickup. And um, as I'm holding them up, you can clearly see the differences um, in sizes and. Uh, so the thing about a P90 is more similar than a humbucker in more ways. You know, you don't have, you have the pole pieces, you have the magnets underneath, you have a base plate, and then you have the bobbin. And uh, with a, a Jazzmaster pickup, as you can see, it's more like a Stratocaster pickup. You have the rod magnets and you have your bobbins and you have your pickup wire around. So. The thing is, they're essentially single coils, and but they are flat. They are really flat, and so the the pickup wire and the bobbin is more is more spread out than on a traditional single coil. So um, they don't have much in common. Um, so putting that aside, um, let's talk about the Jazzmaster pickups. Um, I'm in this set. I'm using different wires for for the bridge and for the neck. In the neck, I'm using a heavy foam var wire, like it is used in vintage Stratocaster single coils, which give them a sort of airy sound, some say. And in the bridge pickup, I'm going to use a regular wire. Um, I'm just going to give you some demo sounds. Um, I'm using a Line 6 HX DOM going directly into GarageBand as a recording interface. Um, I'm using a Princeton type model with a 112 speaker cabinet mic with an SM57 close and a ribbon mic 160 and a little bit of room reverb and um, for the overdrives I'm going to add a uh, Heather Brown Electronicals Blessed Muller pedal and um, as a guitar I'm using a uh, Harley Benton JM. It's a Jazzmaster type guitar. It's not a real Jazzmaster as you can see. It's got a different bridge and everything and it's not got the fancy switching circuit but um, it's got Jazzmaster pickups in it so um, and uh, it's really a really a good guitar. Uh, it's a, a bass wood body with a uh, maple nag and a power ferro fingerboard and it comes at a really good price point it's around 150 euros I guess um, and it's a real really good guitar it's got vintage tuners and everything um, I really like this guitar uh, so I'm going just to show you a quick demonstration of the tones um, and uh, yeah you will see uh, first we'll start with clean tones. I'm going neck, middle, bridge, and then I'm going to uh, give you some overdriven tones. So uh, here we start with the neck. So you see it's got a really nice uh, single coily sound to it um, just right the yeah, amp is right on the edge of breakup so if you dig in the strings really hard uh, you get a nice uh, sound so in the middle pickup gives you that uh, classic uh, sort of in-between thing that you know from tellies or from strats uh, so you'll see <laughs> So 
so you could see really see uh, nice sparkly tones uh, the pickups are wound uh, reverse wound reverse polarity so you get the hum cancelling effect on the in-between positions next up we have the bridge So you see it has that uh, nice uh, bridge snap that you know from tellies or everything. Um, yeah, uh, now I'm going to add a little bit of drive and I'm going back to the neck position. overdriven tone uh, you can hear the strings ring out good so and uh, the pickups are quite touch sensitive so if you have an overdriven amp and you play the strings lightly like this so you see you got lots of dynamics going on there. Um, middle position. And last but not least, bridge sound. Um, yeah, you see it's a real versatile set of pickups. Um, I'm going to add a little bit more boost with the Tube Screamer and gonna add a little bit of delay for some lead sounds. Nothing wrong with that sound. Uh, so you see, it's a really good set of pickups. Um, great all-around set if you're looking for an upgrade for your Jazzmaster guitar or you buy something like this a quite an inexpensive guitar and you want to upgrade your pickups uh, you might consider them um, I think they might add something to your tone and uh, yeah if you like them you can check them out on my website or you can uh, look on my social media profiles uh, I leave links to them in the description below and if you like this video leave me a thumbs up or you can subscribe to my channel everything uh, really thankful of that and uh, thank you for watching and thank you for your time and um, if you have any further questions hit me up or write some comments down below I'll uh, be happy to help you and again thank you for watching and we will see us in the next video bye